Hello, I am Dr. David Burns. I'm a professor emeritus at the University of California, San Diego School of Medicine. Cigarette smoking not only affects the person who smokes, it also affects the people around them. Uh, the same toxins and toxicants that are present in cigarette smoke are also present in the smoke that curls up off the tip of the cigarette and in the smoke that's exhaled by the smoker. That forms what we call environmental tobacco smoke or involuntary smoking. The damage is quite real. It increases the risk of heart disease, increases the risk of uh, lung cancer, it also increases uh, the risk of abnormalities in the lung. It's particularly dangerous for young children. Uh, children uh, in the first couple of years of life are at increased risk of pneumonia, uh, of uh, cough and respiratory illness if their parents smoke. And it's now clear that if uh, the spouse smokes, if the husband smokes, that the wife is at greater risk uh, of complications of pregnancy. So all of those things combined mean that it is quite dangerous uh, for individuals who don't smoke to be exposed to secondhand smoke, which is why there are so many rules and so many regulations that protect non-smokers from secondhand smoke exposure. 